Today I am at Disneyland Paris. Uh, first time here, so come with me, my friends. Let's see if we can find oh. Mickey Mouse. <laughs> Okay, so here we are in uh, Disneyland Paris. It's been a relatively easy um, baggage drop-off. Got our magic passes. It's about 8.35 now. We're going to go in for extra magic hour. Uh, there we go. Try and get on Big Thunder Mountain. That's kind of like the uh, main ride I wanted to do here today. So, um, try and get on that. Unfortunately, uh, Hyperspace Mountain is closed for maintenance. Didn't know that at the time, but um, it's a uh, 365 park. Every day of the year it's open, so you've got to expect rides to be down for maintenance now and again. Unfortunately, it's one of the biggest rides here, but um, it's a reason to come back again, isn't it? So uh, we won't be doing Hyperspace Mountain unless we're extremely lucky and they open it up. I don't think that'll happen though. So um, yeah, Big Thunder Mountain, here we go. We'll do... Um, I do look shots around the park and things later, but it's a uh, rush to get into the rides for early magic time now. Um, make sure we get some rides done while it's quieter. Let's go. There we go. We're just about to walk around the corner for our first view of the castle. There it is. It's all lit up as well. Very pink. There we go. Why is a uh, Disney Castle, or Disneyland Paris Castle, the only one that's pink because of the horrible grey sky in Paris. That's why. <laughs> Fact. Okay, so I'm going to keep rolling. We've got the um, keep taking a look at the castle. Walking down Main Street, USA Main Street. Near the castle. Uh, also the. Uh, Disneyland Paris Castle is the only one that has a dragon underneath it. We will be seeing the dragon later, but not yet. First, we head round to Big Thunder Mountain. And <laughs> Just getting a shot of uh, places. I'm just going to get any genuine views, really. This is my um, first time at a Disney park, and my wife's as well. Nice. Yeah. Feel the magic yet? <laughs> yeah. Now she feels the magic. I love that. <laughs> so great. Frontierland, that's where we're headed. Uh, this is uh, the ride I've kind of like wanted to do since I was a child. Well, yeah, I suppose you can say that. Even the Paris one. As hopefully, the queue won't be too big. But we'll see. We'll see. Don't actually know where things are. I kind of seen the maps, but kind of like got to work it out from the maps that I've seen. Oh, here we go, Frontierland. The um, cowboyish area. Big Thunder Mountain, there it is. Beautiful. You looking forward to Big Thunder Mountain? You know it? Do you know what it is? No. No? Roller coaster. Roller coaster, honey. There it goes. Yeah. Yeah. Oh, yeah. Um, Phantom Manor over there. Over there. We'll, get, we'll do that later. I think that's open at 9.30 that one, so um, that's not early ride time. So we'll keep looking around. Just trying to get you uh, shots as we're walking. I'm this place is just full of content. 
<laughs> you could uh, spend a spend a week here getting shots. Exit. Disabled that one. Oh. Don't know what the time is. What's the wait time on this? Go on. Please be less than 20 minutes. Five minutes, honey. Five minutes. <laughs> Take on the running. It's on five minutes. There we go. Do this. Five minutes. Five minutes. There we go, guys. That's exactly what I wanted to see. Big Thunder Mountain on five minutes. Hello. Bonjour. <laughs> yeah, see, that's nice. You're always welcoming us. Check it out the queue line out. There it goes. Oh, I'm excited. Can you tell? <laughs> there we go. I'm have to talk to a cast member at some point and get a first time badge. Get a first. I know you. I know you get a first time badge if you say it's your first time at Disney. You'll get a first time. <laughs> there it goes. Look, it's a beautiful mountain there. So it starts over here. And then it goes under the water and then it goes around the mountain. There we go. I'm going to turn you off for a bit, guys. Hope you've enjoyed the look at the queue line. Uh, I need to put my uh, GoPro on quickly. There we go. So there we go, we've just done um, Big Thunder Mountain. That's not it, that's the castle. Um, fantastic, I really enjoyed that. Lovely smooth coaster, uh, quite a long one. Uh, brilliant, the theming, unbelievable. Fantastic theming on there, fantastic coaster. It was walk on, we got straight on, uh, not even waited in the queue, straight away. Brilliant, fantastic uh, early riding time. Uh, is it worth it? God, I think it is worth it to get that extra hour. You have to rush around, uh, get here nice and early, you've got to get up early, but um, I think it's worth it. If you want to get those short queues, you've got to get that early, uh, early riding time. Extra magic time. So here we go, we're going to head over to uh, Star Tour now, see if we can get on the Star Wars ride. This is a, a flat ride, 
I'll show you when we're going around, of course. We can take you on all the rides here. It's not like Merlin Park. I can take you on the rides, uh, which is fantastic. Uh, Merlin should learn from Disney, although I think Disney are learning from Merlin. And I think they're going to cut out um, online filming at some point, so uh, we're lucky to get it on, lucky to get it where we can. But I think it's going to go. So uh, yeah, it's supposed to be the last day of Christmas yesterday, but we've still got Christmas decorations up and that, so we get a little taster of uh, what Christmas was like here. I say that because there's one of the stages here, one of the Christmas stages. But I don't think we'll be getting any uh, Christmas shows or anything like that. Um, that was, uh, that all finished yesterday. Ooh. And that's why, that's why we came today, because um, it would be quieter after the Christmas period. And by the looks of it, it's really quiet at the minute. Like I said, it was walk-on. Big Thunder Man and advertised at five minutes. Uh, it's walk-on. Brilliant, let's see what Star Tours is like. I think we're going the wrong way. I think we should probably want to go over there, don't we? <laughs> don't know the layout of the park. I kind of like know where things are, but um, uh, it's a bit different when you get there from looking at the map, isn't it? Uh, you soon get used to it because um, it's basically, you've got the central hub. Central point is um, the castle and this main area around the front, in front of the castle. Uh, USA Main Street and then uh, um, and then everything, all the, all the little sections that are off from it uh, which you can see it's a small world over there, that's closed it's under maintenance, it's been closed for a long time um, I, I guess they're changing everything in there to stop being so um, how do we delicately put it uh, racist <laughs> I can't put that delicately. Some of those scenes are pretty racist. But um, yeah, I think they're changing those scenes to be a bit more in keeping with the times. But there we go, this is lovely. So here we go, filming again. Uh, next stop, like I said, Star Tours. Just walked past Buzz Lightyear, that's on five minutes. We'll probably do that after this one. Um, get as much as we can done in this uh, extra hour. Uh, keep going on about it, but it's brilliant, isn't it? Get, get that extra hour done, and, um, and then we can chill out in the park and do bits and pieces. If we get three or four rides done in extra magic time, then we can just chill out for the rest of the day. Uh, so here, here we go, five minutes, although people are standing there doing nothing, which doesn't look good. Uh, oh, they are letting them through. So here we go. We have an X Wing up there. Oh, I did get, there was a better shot earlier. Yeah. <laughs> Star Tours. There it is, the X Wing. So the thing about Star Tours is you can get um, lots of different goes. The scenes are different, lots of different scenes. So you've got kind of loads of different ways of stories to see. So um, you can go on this over and over again and get a different ride every time. So here we go. Let's see what our first ride is going to be. Uh, I'd like to see a bit of Ray, personally. But uh, we'll see what happens. Here we go. Oh, I didn't know C-3PO, but, but I would say he speaks, I can't remember how many languages he speaks, but he does speak a lot of languages. He's out to just wait for the lady to take her pictures. So normally uh, you'd have plenty of time to take pictures in the queue, but there's no queue, so um, we're just going straight in. Got the droid bay around here, look. Oh. Well, 
that's what you call walk on. There we go, we'll turn you off. There we go. Je ne sais quel problème Cet espion rebelle se trouve à bord. C'est la première fois que je vois cet être humain. Oh, ciel, je dois y aller. Ne sous-estimez pas mon pouvoir. Je veux cet espion. Mais quel Quelqu'un pourra être blessé. So we go. First time on a Star Tours. That was really good. Really good fun. Flight simulator type thing. Um, we got Darth Vader. Was it pod racing? And uh, above Coruscant. Coruscant. Uh, that, was, uh, that was really nice. Good fun. Uh, really good uh, feelings as you go around uh, the uh, hyperspace. Region. We're going to go over to Buzz Light, yeah. Hopefully that's still on five minutes. Uh, don't know what the time is, we're just crashing around getting what we can done. So there we go, Buzz Light, yeah, I'll just show you this. We've got the Orbitron going on, because we probably won't be getting on it. Not unless every single thing we do today is five minutes. But I doubt that will happen. But that's kind of like low down on the list of stuff I want to do. That's only if I've got all the big rides done. Twice. <laughs> there it is. Like I say, hyperspace mountain in there, closed for maintenance, so we won't be getting that. This is nice, look. 
the um, Videoopolis. I don't actually know what is in there. Oh, it's food. It's a food hall. So there you go. But it looks nice though. All very um, steampunk, futuristic. There we go. There he is, Buzz Lightyear Laser Blast. It's a shooting dark ride, but apparently a pretty good one. Let's do it. There's a key line. Oh look, I knew who that is. It's Woody. Didn't know they don't know Woody meet and greet. Look forward to the flight deck for immediate launch to infinity and beyond. He said it. He said it. Thank goodness for that. I'm just filming um, the queue lines because I don't know what's coming. It might be something I could quickly need to film. So, um, so I'll read. Who do you think is going to win, me or you? Yeah, I'm terrible. She always wins at shooting games. Okay, so we did Buzz Lightyear. Yeah, that was good fun. Um, shoot you right. Wife couldn't get the hang of it much. I won. Uh, that was good. Nice little ride. Just been looking around for food, I think. Um, place is open at 11.30 here. We've just been here. It's 10.30, so we're going to wait an hour and then get something to eat. So we've decided to come into um, Pirates of the Caribbean on five minutes, apparently. Let's go in, take a look. Right, here we go. We've got the uh, queue line here. I'll show you as much as I can in the queue line, of course. Lots of uh, cannonballs. Like we're going through the cells and things here. There we go. Constantly moving though, isn't it? That's the thing. It's, uh, made for a massive input uh, throughput, isn't it? So, so the ride, the film, is based on the ride. Yeah, the, the ride came first. Nice one. <laughs> Look out. Yeah, I there. It's five minutes. What by the time you get there, it's um doesn't feel long if you're constantly moving a little bit, does it? Okay, here we go. No seat belts. I'm excited about this one. This is one of my top list ones to do. So here would be a normal restaurant people would be eating here after 11.30. Lovely though, isn't it? Right. 
this is my this is my top one. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, wait for time to know. Yeah, it's nice. Yeah. The old uh, birds and uh, treasure. Look at the crab. Oh, very atmospheric. Midnight. New moon. Oh. Fireflies.
Fantastic uh, immersion. I suppose we'll get that a lot on this trip. Very immersive. Uh, really enjoyed it. The best theming for a ride so far. So that's our fourth ride. We're doing pretty good. It's what, 11 o'clock now? So we're doing pretty well. Now we're getting on uh, what you just seen Phantom Manor. 13 minute queue. It's the longest queue we've had so far, but we'll see how, how we do. It was five minutes, about five minutes ago. <laughs> but. Um, yeah, let's go on. 13 minute queue. I guess it means 15, but they like to put 13 in, you know. So here we go. Let's jump on Phantom Manor and see what that's like. Welcome, curious friends. You sense a disquieting metamorphosis. Hélas, les choses ne sont pas toujours ce qu'elles paraissent. Tous les contes n'ont pas de fin heureuse. It appears everyone is doomed at Phantom Manor. Even you? Notice this. This chamber has no windows and no doors, which offers you this chilling challenge to find a way out. <laughs> Oh, my God. 
On, um, Phantom Manor here. That was really good. Really enjoyed that. Um, lots to look at in the scenes. Loads to look at. Um, don't know how much the camera picked up. I'll just do um, just putting highlights there for you because it's quite dark throughout. But uh, really good. That was a great ride. We'll do that again. I think. Very nice. So we've decided to eat in the Lucky Nugget Saloon, I think it's called. Uh, we get a choice of, um, was it, there's a, we had the celebration menu, which is a burger one. And then there's uh, pork ribs, or there's fish and chips, or vegetarian burger. I've gone for the celebration menu. She's gone for the uh, vegan one, vegetarian. And uh, yeah, it's all a set menu, so it all comes with fries, drink, dessert. So. Um, how much was it? 30 euros each? 54 for the two of us. Uh, not bad, sit down menu. I said, gonna spin you around and uh, this is lovely, this is. Look, let's look at this. Beautiful, beautiful. There's even more seating at the top. I think um, at, at times little shows come on, they do little dances and dance things. But, um, it's potluck when you catch them, I think. But I think the trick is, wait as long as you can before, until they start dancing and stuff. Yeah, it's all still decorated for Christmas, even though the last Christmas day was yesterday. There we go. It's like a saloon, like resting. Nice. I'll turn you off until we see the food. Okay, there's mine. 
we've got sort of like a dirty fries, I think we've got um, onion maybe on top, onion and mayonnaise. The burger looks nice. You showing your hands, they're vegetarian one. We'll tell you what we think later. Right, so here we have my um, is it caramel mousse with an apple, stewed apple or something inside. Quite nice. It goes well with the apple. Got this um, caramel biscuit thing with a Mickey on it. There's my Mickey. She's got Sunday. It's basically ice cream and sauce, right? Yeah. Mine's better. Thank <laughs> you.